Alright, this is where you get to pick your little guys. I'm not really sure what they're called. They're just calling it your crew. Uh, let's see, we got Moon, Nails, and Pam so far. And you don't have to take these, you can reshuffle them. Uh, i tell you right now, you got to watch out for some stuff here. The stress response. I try to avoid the destructive people because in this game right now, in Alpha, the stress is not very well managed. So when they start getting stressed out, they start breaking stuff. And they start getting stressed out for no reason. <laughs> and a lot of the stuff that's supposed to manage it isn't really working all that well. So I try to avoid anybody that's destructive. Uh, small bladder, they're going to pee every so often a lot more than normal. Gastrophobia, these guys are constantly farting, which ruins your air. Narcoleptic will drop out. <laughs> Random times they'll just drop and go to sleep. Uh, you gotta watch out for that. Um, these uh, green ones, I really haven't seen a whole lot about it. Uh, difference anyway. Uh, the decor expectations. Decor, I'm sorry. Uh, if this is a high number, they're going to expect to see paintings and plants and statues, or they're gonna, their stress rate goes up faster. Uh, so you want to try to keep that as low as possible. Some of them are negative, which is great. Uh, up here in the attributes, uh, the, you want to watch for certain things. You're going to want at least one person's creative, but you don't have to start out with them. It doesn't hurt, though. Digging and construction seem to be the most important things right off the bat. Um, so, like this one's 12 to digging, but you know this this destructive right here is a hell no. Destructive. All right, we got a vomiter. Okay, the vomiting ones, I, it's disgusting, but it's actually later on you'll find that it's helpful. Um, when they get stressed out, they barf everywhere and they create a pool of a vomit, which causes it goes up in the air and causes to it, it hurts your air so you have to mop it up um but later on i can show you uh, interesting ways of capturing the vomit and using it to your advantage uh this one not so good athletics okay tinkering I don't, i'm not really sure what that does I'm, they explain it they do tribute determines a du replicants a duplicates efficiency when operating machines eh destructive. There we got a vomiter. Uh, tinkering again. Loud sleeper. Oh, watch out for these guys. The snorers. I'll show you what that is about later. When you're building your beds, make sure you put them at least four spaces apart or if they snore, they'll wake up the other ones. And if they don't get any sleep, they get stressed out and you got problems. Oh, I love when you get these. Alright. Plus one to pretty much everything. Athletic. The athletic attribute determines a duplicate's movement speed. Nice. All right, we might keep this guy. Um, he's a yokel. Let's turn this guy. Egyptian is the brightest star in the sky. Cannot perform job. Oh, this guy can't do research. Not a huge loss. I got two other ones that can do research. Twinkle toes. This duplicate is light as a feather on their feet. Okay. Plus seven to athletics. That's where he got that from. Huh. Decor's not too high. Vomiter's great. I know it sounds disgusting, but trust me, later on you'll figure out why. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna change his name. He's gonna be Bob. I got a friend named Bob, and he fits right into that. Nails. All right. Gassy. Don't really care about that too much. He's vomiter. Early bird. Mm. The athletics is nice. The strength is okay. The strength attribute determines a duplicates carry capacity uh, that could be helpful I'm not a major attribute that I'm worried about though they don't carry a lot of stuff around anyway uh, decor expectations aren't high I'm not really interested in that one I'm going to pass on the destructives there's a vomiter mouth breather what the hell does that do anyway the duplicate sucks up way more than their fair share of oxygen which is a bad thing plus 100 damn Pass. Ooh, not destructive, not interested. Mmm, no. No, no. No, 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 no. Vomiter, plus five to digging, plus six to construction, bottomless stomach, they're gonna eat a lot. Not a huge problem. Run rate, 
My, uh, a little bit of higher burn rate. Low expectations on that. Mole hands. This is a digger right here. Level six architect. All right, we're we're gonna keep this guy. Man, we might have to change the names. You're gonna be Bill. This guy is gonna be Bob. All right, let's go look at Pam here. Uh, no, no narcoleptics. They're just annoying. Pass, pass, pass. Digging, construction, learning's good. That, that never hurts. They actually gain skill over time. Determines a, a duplicate skill training and research effectiveness. That's a good thing. Um, we actually need somebody that's good at research. We should look for one that's good at research. Because a lot of that other stuff, we, you have to do research. Dang, no. Hmm. Nope, narcoleptic. Not interested. Oh, that was probably a good. One. I probably passed on a good one, but we'll go. But we'll we'll go around again and see what we get. Ooh, uh, destructive pass. I don't do destructives. Damn it, that's a good one too. Uh, come on. Damn it. <laughs> nope. Ooh, he's a, he's a farter. Uh, he's a quick learner. That's good. Plus 47 to research. We need that. The tinkering helps because he's going to be working on the research machines. He's a quick learner. Sharp as attack and picks up new skills and amazing speed. Oh. The decor is a little high, but I can. He'll just be stressed out and barping all the time, which will come in handy. Mm, what shall we call him? Hmm. Let's call him Nerdus. Oh, we're going to have to name our colony. Not really important, seriously. I'm just going to call it colony because I'm boring. Oh, let's reshuffle. Let's see what happens. The cute crater, not so radical beyond, penetrable beyond, penetrable beyond, the not so cool bureau. Supernova. Sold. 